I'm Dr. Megan Leeds. I'm the Assistant Dean of Student Affairs here at Regis University School of Pharmacy. Okay. Pneumonia comes from the pneumococcal uh, bacteria, and so that can cause pneumonia, bacteremia, which is an infection in your blood, or uh, meningitis. But pneumonia can be prevented by getting two vaccines. One is the PCV13, which is known as Prevnar, and the other is Pneumovax 23, which is PPSV 23. One is particularly meant for children, which is the Prevnar 13 that's given to children under two years of age, actually starting at two months, four months, six months, and 12 to 15 months. So you'll have four doses by the time the child is two years old. And then the other population that's at risk for pneumonia is over 65, and that is the Pneumovax 23 that's particularly recommended, and then also um, the Prevnar 13. The changes are that everybody should still, over 65, should still get the Pneumovax 23. The Prevnar 13 is a discussion to have with your doctor or pharmacist. If you want that extra coverage, or if you have a medical condition such as asthma, COP, anything that would suscept, be more susceptible to a lung disease, um, chronic smoking, something like that, you would definitely also want to get that Prevnar 13. They're given about a year apart and they have different coverage. Um, the Prevnar 13 covers 13 strains of the pneumococcal vaccine and the Pneumovax 23 covers 23 different strains. So together, um, you get a lot more coverage. You cannot get the pneumonia uh, diseases, so like I talked about, the lung infection, uh, bacteremia, or uh, meningitis from this uh, vaccine. Uh, it's an inactivated, so it's not live, and um, the most it may cause is some um, injection site reaction or a little fever, um, headache, something like that, something that could be uh, mitigated with Tylenol or ibuprofen, um, but overall, it is a very safe vaccine. <laughs>